Aloha everyone, this is Max with Asian Geek Squad, and today we're going to walk you through the new features of iMessage running on iOS 10. Now, the first thing you'll notice is you'll see three particular icons on the lower left. If you tap on the camera, there you go, that, launch, that launches your camera, and if you swipe to the left, you'll see the camera, the photo library, and if you swipe to the right, you'll see all of the current videos, photos, screenshots that you currently have in your library. Now the next one, the one with the heart and the fingers on it, this one's pretty cool. Now this has similar features of Apple Watch. It allows you to write messages directly on the screen to be sent to your significant other, your friend, or whoever you're messaging. The cool thing is you can change colors. You'll see on the left you have red, blue, white, and the cool thing about this as well is on the right side, it teaches, it tells you finger gestures that you can use to actually customize your message even more. So you can draw, for example, a heart, or here in this case, a kiss, a fireball by holding one finger down on the screen. Then you can tap two fingers for a heart. And if you hold your two fingers and pull down, that's when you'll get the heartbreak. Now, if for those of you who want to write even more customized message or a bigger message as a canvas per se, on the lower right, you'll see the up arrow. Now, if you tap on that, you will actually have the whole screen to write on. So that's pretty cool. Instead of just writing, trying to squeeze in a limited message on a small screen, now you can write, doodle, draw. Um, I'm not very artistic, so I'm sorry that I have a writing of a fifth grader. <laughs> All right, so the next thing you'd have to do is actually tap on the word keep, and I've tapped on keep on the lowest message, and you can see that it's been delivered. And if you have read message, confirmed, then you'll actually get a confirmation when the other person has read the message. Now, next up is the App Store. And of course, that is indicated by the letter A. There you go. And here, this pretty much is like an emoji screen. But the different thing is on the left side, on the lower left, where you see the four circle dots, this brings up all of your, all of your the things you have purchased and the applications that are compatible with iMessage and if you tap on the plus then it brings you to the App Store. If this is your first time you'll have to accept the terms and conditions in order to be able to use this particular App Store. And I've already downloaded a couple and make sure to check out all the free ones. So Retro Emoji is the free one that um, I've downloaded already and all you do is you would swipe from right to left to bring up all the different applications. So here we'll just send one to my sister and then we'll swipe again. And well, now you guys know that it's gonna rain here in Hawaii for the next week. Yay, hurricanes now rain. We just, yeah. <laughs> and now we have Super Mario, music and so forth. So this is actually just a really cool update. It allows you to customize your messages even more and yeah, make sure you check out the free apps. And if you guys have any questions about iMessage iOS 10, don't forget to leave us a comment down below. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing. Aloha.